What do you want? I am here to apologize because of what happened in my compound yesterday. You almost killed me. Would you be here apologizing if I had died? Huh. Thank the gods that nothing happened to you. I One more step towards me and I will rain my witch's fire on you. I'm sorry. I mean no harm. I'm only here to apologize because of what happened yesterday and, and also to let you know that I'm I'm still interested in you. I want to take you as my wife. Please. Actually, I just finished a discussion with your son. He has made his intentions known. <laughs> that is good news. Which means we are close to achieving our aim. And I'll be forever grateful to you if your son marries me and take away this curse of me. There is no if. Certainly, he will marry you. <gasps> I cannot wait for that to happen. I can't wait. It will happen very soon. <laughs> I believe you. I believe you. Onye? Onye, what, what's the meaning of this? What is the meaning of it? You just passed me with that word. That is exactly what your mother wants. How do you mean that is what my mother wants? Please don't pretend as if you don't know what your mother told me. Yesterday, I came looking for you at your hut. Only I don't know anything. What did my mother tell you? What did she say to you? Place of meeting later in the day. Adako. What is happening to me? Why is it that I always have have the Z to to kill? Oh. Because of our land. Because of our land, please. Please save me from this unforeseen spirit. Save me from this unseen spirit. Because of our land. What is wrong with me? What is wrong with me? Who did I offend? Who did I offend?
someone is being attacked. Who could this be? Blood stain on your face. Mm. Oh, I might kill the rat on my way to your hut. You and the rats. Why will you stop killing rats? Will I ever stop? Mama, rat meat is the best meat ever. It's not true, and you know it. Eat your food, let me bring water for you. <laughs> Thank you, Mama. Now, thank the God. Yeah. <laughs> 
Okay, Mary. you is the boundary between the living and the dead I'm almost crossing over to be with my ancestors you cannot stop me I did not just come to stop you I came to take you back to life no way you cannot <laughs> okay. In the real world, you were powerful. But here, in the spirit world, you were powerless. I do not want to force you. But if you continue resisting me, I will. Okay, Millie. You should stop wasting time here. Look at the back of your head. You will see an injury. I will soon decay if you do not follow me out of this place. No wound at the back of my head. The more I keep discussing this with you, the worse things become. Thank you, Mama, for the food. You are welcome, Mama. <laughs> I think I want you to stop coming here. Um, Mama, take it easy. You can see that she's crying. What is the problem? Okay, Millie is dead. Hey. What? Are you serious? I saw him lying in the pool of his own blood. My son? Where? 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 In the, in the bush. Take me there. Take me there. Okay. Take me there. Take me there. Hey. Thank the ghost. Finally, he's dead. I can now possess everything that belongs to Joe Woma. Yes. Yes. Return to your body.
Okay, Mili. Okay, Mili. Ah. Ah. My head. My head. And my neck. I, I can't. I can't get up. You can try. Ah, no, I can't. Take my hand. Take my hand. Try. Here. He was lying down here. Where is he? Mama, I left him here to come and call you. You killed my son. No problem about that. But to hide his body from me is what I am not going to accept from you. I beg you, by the cause of this land, show me where you kept his body. Can you say that? How can you say I treated him? If by sunset today you did not show me where you hid his body, what I am going to do to you, you will not like it. Oh. Mama! He was lying down here. Mama! Mama, wait! Mama, come! Mama! Mama! Please! Mama, it's not like that! Mama! Mother. Mother, is it true that he's dead? I don't know. What do you mean by you don't know? I did not see his body. How? She killed my son and hid his body from me. The Ugo Kendo wants to hear this and they will gather because of me and that useless girl. This is confusing. How is she even sure that he's dead? My son is dead. She refused to show me the body where she hid it. What am I doing here? Where am I? You were dead. I brought you back to life. How is that possible? <laughs> well, with people with supernatural powers. Someone attacked you in the bush and left you seriously injured. Who was that? I can't remember anyone attacking me. Not to talk of injuring me. Think. Someone attacked you in the bush and hit your head with a log of wood. 
कुछ अपनी Maybe you should tell me what you are doing in the bush. I should ask you that. Where could she have gone to? She told me she was going to make her her discussion with Okemiri very brief. Eh? Maybe I should go to Okemiri's hut and look for her. Mother, I have to be on my way now. Okay, my son. Take good care of yourself. I will. <laughs> You are very stupid for asking me such questions. When did I become a keeper? Sorry. Sorry for yourself and get out of my sight. Mother, why are you always harsh on these maidens? I don't like them. I don't want to do anything with them. Okay, I have to go my way now. Okay. Remember what I told you. Take good care of yourself. I will. <laughs> You really have to find who attacked you to stop further attacks. Else, the next time he or she may attack, he will not survive it. I think I got it now. Someone attacked me with a log of wood. I guess, but... I... You remember? Who is it? I don't know. I, 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 I didn't see the face. It's alright. Like I said before, you really have to be careful. The next time this person attacks, you may not survive it. Thank you very much. I may leave now. Go away. Thank you. Why did you ask us to come? My son is dead. May the gods forbid. When did this happen? Earlier today. Earlier today? Uh, how did it happen? Onye killed my son. And to make the matter worse, she hid the body from me. Two things at a time. Yes. Where is she now? The last time I saw her was earlier today, when she took me to the bush, where she killed my son. And unfortunately, his body was not found. <laughs> Honestly, I cannot comprehend all you have just said. What I want from both of you is to tell Onye to produce the body of my son. And secondly, to convince Igwe to commit her to death. There is no problem about that. But first, we need to hear from her. Mm -hmm. Yes. We need to hear from, from her. Mm? I just told you exactly what happened. 
There is no problem. We have heard all you said. did not kill him, then who killed him? Who? I don't know. Believe me, I don't know what happened. I can see that you don't want to say the truth about the death of Okemiri. And we will have no regret asking the king to commit you to death. Please, I am innocent. I swear I am innocent. I did not do anything. I don't kill him. I Listen. swear. You are innocent. Yes. Listen. Where is the dead body? Where did you keep it? I don't know. Believe don't me, know. I don't know. Everything happened so fast. I was... Hey! Did I hear you say <laughs> everything happened very fast? <laughs> and to cover up your <laughs> evil deed, you have to hide his dead body. Hey! When, Onye, you have from now to sunset to return the dead body to his mother. 
If not, you are as good as dead person. Wicked woman. Let's go. Don't touch me. The discussion is over. Now leave! Leave! Once she eats the fish, she will become unconscious and I will take advantage of her without delay. And after that, she will never see me again. Son, and you will not get away with it. Oh, yeah, you are a hardened murderer. Even as you stare death at face, you still lie. Eh? Use of our land, stone her to death. Wicked woman, no. stone her to death. <laughs> <laughs> I brought you something special. Are you serious? What did you bring for me? Dry fish. I prepared it myself. Oh, I like it. Thank you. <laughs> he added mm. sleeping magic to my fish. It's very sweet. <laughs> Thank the girls, you like it. Oh. Um, it's more. I prepared it specially for you. So, it's more. You okay. can finish all if you want. What does he want to achieve? Now I get it. He wants to make me sleep. So he will have a carnal knowledge of me. But little did he know that magic of any kind can never affect me. Enough! 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 enough. <laughs> Are you now ready to talk? Or do you want us to finish you up? I did not feel him. I cannot accept what I did not do. I had to die. That's why I accept what I did not do. Youth of our land, finish her up.
me. To him, he thinks he has gotten me. <laughs> Small thoughts, I must say. I feel like sleeping. Sleeping? But we are still talking. Yes. So deserted. What is happening? I don't know. Anytime everywhere looks like this, everyone in this kingdom must have been at the village square. Yes. Okay. Is this you? Yes, it's me. Any problem? I thought you are dead because your mother accused Donyo of killing you. What? Come on, Onye cannot hurt me. She can't kill me. That means you have to hurry to the village square because they are about to stone Onye to death. Onye. What? I could not withstand it. It was a terrible sight. So I had to leave. Please hurry to the village square before they kill her. Let's hurry. We need to, need to hurry before they kill her. Ogoli ne chaba, mwa mambo no biyo Udala me cham, achali uko wanyo So so ge kama, so ge kupi muna cho Ije lofu mu, bia tike ne mo biyo Asam pete wanyi wada de mao Apu na uo ge kana ponyo Ema so so ge kama, so ge kupi muna cho Ije lofu mu, ya tikene mubi yo Oyo yo wakoma kwa ge kama muna cho Let's hurry. Thank you. You are awake. <laughs> I was never unconscious. Actually, you just lifted me off a body. How do you mean? You see, I was born with a curse that forbids me from living among humans. So I live here in the bush. Because if I live among humans at the slightest provocation, I may kill them all. But now that you have had carnal knowledge of me, that cause has been lifted. And the effect on you is death. You cannot scare me with those words. I have gotten what I want and I'm out of here.
Okay, Miri. Ojinye, there's something I would like the both of you to know. Um, you're a brother and sister. In fact, you're twins. Yes. You see, when your mother had you, for the fear of the killing of twins, she asked the midwife to take you, Onyenye, far away from this land. Yes. So, the day Okemili almost died, the gods revealed it to me. That is why, whenever the both of you want to make love, the gods have prevented it. If you think I'm, if you don't believe me, look at your, your armpit. There's a mark there and it's very similar. Look at it. It's the truth. Yes, you're connected by blood. Now I know the reason why the gods saved my life. That day, that moment, I thought I was going to die. When I was about giving up the hope of being alive, he came and saved me. Initially, I thought he was going to marry me. What a small word. Honestly, I don't know that I was going to say this. But I have to say it. Akaraka. My brother loves you. He told me. Please, can you love him back and make a good wife to him? Can you do that? <laughs> Surely, I will make a good wife to him. Then say no more. <laughs> it's done. It takes pure love to thwart the evil plans of my stepmother against me. Well, I feel no remorse for her. You're very innocent. I couldn't have killed you. Well, even if I wanted to. The gods wouldn't have allowed me. All the evil she planned against you finally fell upon her. And she couldn't survive it. It's always like that, you know, when you plan evil to people and it unfolds. It usually backfire with great consequences. You're yeah, exactly, my dear, you're right. Just as it was to my stepmother. She really ate from her pot of evil. And you see why it's not good to do evil. Because <laughs> it's very disastrous on the plan. So, what do I call you now? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, but right now, I still love you. Please do something. <laughs>